Well, the nationwide teacher shortage is no stranger to the Lone Star State, and this school year, Valley School Districts are bringing uncertified teachers on board. One district we spoke with earlier says that it's all part of a program aimed at getting more educators the credentials that they need. Our Blake Brown explains. Chris Valdez is the interim superintendent of Mission CISD. She says the teacher shortage has been affecting some departments more than others. At this time, maybe in some high critical areas, uh, maybe a gap here and there, but that would be in uh, special education. Uh, throughout the region and the state, obviously, there's a shortage in teachers, right? That's what the data has, has been indicating. That data was compiled by the Texas Education Agency. It indicates an increase in teachers without state certification by 34% this school year, or over 16,000 new hires. Valdez calls them alternate certified teachers, meaning although they are lacking credentials, they are actively working towards earning their certification. We're providing the supports for new teachers that are new to education, right, and didn't study to become teachers and didn't take the traditional path, but that's okay. She says their school's priority is to create a pipeline for them to become certified by getting the experience in classrooms with mentors. So if they just increase more money to the mentor program allotment, school districts are then able to provide those kind of resources for new teachers and especially those coming in from an alternative certification program. She says along with educator prep programs, she believes they can retain their staff through better compensation and pay. Working for you in the city of Mission, I'm Blake Brown.